Hello, this is MechaJ101, and here's a little crazy experiment I um, am doing right now. So I've got both my 10 amp Variax um, connected up here. Um, so this one right here um, is connected to the plug. So, and then I've got this other heavy duty wire going around here a couple times, um, probably about oh, six times, and that's shorted out. But this one is not connected up to anything. Here's the plug for that one, and. Well, it's basically an isolation transformer, um, but it doesn't. The core is not connected. It's this copper wire that's actually um, connecting th them together. So um, this doesn't actually. If this is not shorted out, there's not many amps going through this. So I'll just turn it on right now. So it is on right now, and as you can see, this is the one that's on. So that one's plugged in, but this one, the light is on there. So this has juice going through it right now. And there's about 14 amps coming out of right there. Um, and it's actually not too bad. I mean, it's not it's not all that inefficient. But there's a little bit of current going in there right now. And then if I short it out. So we're pulling 17 amps off the outlet. Um, and then if we... So this wire right here actually has a ton of current going through it. Um, so I'll short this out again. And we get 600 amps right there, so that's not bad. Um, and then, well, right now it's just sitting there standby. Um, it's basically only drawing 12 amps through this heavy-duty cable. So, um, and then if we actually plug this second variac in, um, then we get um, twice the amps. Well, actually, they're kind of fighting each other. So now we're getting a lot more amps out of here. Um, so, do that. Right. Oh, there we go. Almost, almost a thousand amps there. And it just blew my little breaker on here, so. But yeah, it works pretty good. And I get a nice big spark off of here, too. Which I should have something under here so I don't melt the carpet. But, let me just check the voltage. See how many volts we're getting there. So, both variacs are on right now. So one is kind of adding to the voltage of the other one right now. So we're getting six volts, almost six volts AC off there. And if we touch those together, we get a nice bit of sparking and melting. So yeah, pretty big. Yeah, so, so yeah, I just thought that was pretty cool. Little experiment. Um, and also off of these cables right here, we get a good bit of sparks too but that's much lower voltage so there might be more amps there I'm not really sure how many amps there are there but there's less voltage because it's only one turn 700 amps but not much voltage it's only probably one volt maybe so yeah I just thought that was kind of a cool little experiment and um, with Variax if you take them apart um, you can um, get some pretty nice amperage out of them yeah, I was drawing a bit of current there because these are pretty warm, <laughs> even though they're 10 amp variacs. But so yeah, it's just th thought it was a little cool experiment there. So um, that's about it. Thanks for watching.